Listen to me. And I want you to believe that I know what I'm saying. I don't mean to insult your pedigree. I know that there are very successful people here, but I know something small about success. I can tell you, no matter what you believe you have, if you lack the power to get wealth, you are going to be frustrated. You will see things passing in front of you, but for your hand to hold your portion, it may never hold it. I'm saying this particularly to businessmen. Don't waste your time moving around saying, I know this one, I know this one. There are forces in the spirit that control results. Your destiny helper does not come because you want them. There is something on you that draws them to you. They can pass you every day. You can even live in the same neighborhood. You can take your, they will never help you except that which is to come, comes upon you. Please listen to what I'm telling you. God wants to end this cycle of frustration. Oh, so, 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 so person in government. He is my man. Forget all that story. If you believe that magically, just because you are related, somebody will help you. Please think again. Think again. It doesn't work that way. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runneth over. He does not anoint your cup. It is your head he anoints. But when that anointing touches your head, your cup must react to it. Thou anointest my head with oil. My business runneth over. My job runneth over. The ministry God has given me runneth over. Do you believe what you are hearing? Some of you this night, even before midnight, this night, before midnight, in the name of Jesus Christ, my God will surprise you in ways that you will marvel and you will wonder. Every man is a maximum of four helpers away. Listen to me. This has been statistically proven. No matter what kind of help you need in this life, from a human standpoint, every man is maximum four helpers away. For some of you, you have struggled and there are wicked spirits that will not let you rise. Not let your children rise. Not let your ministry rise. Wicked spirits that have vowed, as I brought your father down, I will bring you down too. As I brought your sisters, I will bring you down too. Welcome to the house of God. This is Mount Zion. And the Bible says upon Mount Zion that there shall be deliverance and holiness and the sons of Jacob shall possess their possession. I'm telling you, those, those wicked, negative, demonic circles, tonight, right here in this place, they will come to a permanent end in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah.